Hello everybody, this is Andrea Russo reporting here from Whitney, Ontario here on May 27th, 2020. As you can see, the birds are singing, the sun is shining, and everything is emerging, except for one thing, human beings. Recently, there has been a lot of drama here at Black Fly Festival headquarters at Camp Bongo Picks. The fate of the festival remains as so many others before it, cancelled. Earlier this morning, reports emerged of some serious tension brewing here at the Black House administration. Um, Your Highness, uh, I've got some bad news. <sighs> what? What is it? They cancelled the Black Fly Festival. I don't believe it! I know. Guess why? Coronavirus. This disrupts the entire supply chain of blood. My minions will be awakening this weekend. How am I supposed to feed them? There will be riots. This is going to cost me the next election! These are unprecedented times. The fact is, due to physical and social distancing protocols, blood supply levels have plummeted, throwing the entire market into disarray. 30% of black flies all across Northern Ontario are currently unemployed. Blood thirst is becoming a major problem. Uh, this just in some breaking news. We have a special message coming directly from the Lord of the Flies at the Black House. Citizens. It has come to my attention that you humans must not congregate for the sake of the coronavirus spread. As such, I was notified that your Black Fly Festival was cancelled. We commend your generous annual offering of blood, and in the interest of continued friendly diplomatic relations, we recommend to enjoy this year's Black Fly Festival at home, broadcasted on the internet. Please visit my Black Fly website for more details. Well, that's huge and exciting news. Uh, and now in getting some more details here regarding the Black Fly Festival, it will now be a telethon, so the Black Fly Festival telethon. And it sounds like, yeah, it's going to air on the Bongo Picks Facebook page from 7 p.m to 11 p.m. on June 13th. And what I'm also hearing is that it's going to be held in conjunction with the St. Francis Valley Healthcare Foundation. So any proceeds raised will go to support local healthcare in this rural area. Uh, the Whitney Blackfly Band will also be hosting the telethon and it'll feature performers that are local here to Whitney and South Algonquin. Excellent, well, that's fantastic news. So we'll see you online at the Black Fly Festival then on June 13th. This is Andrea Russo reporting for Opiongo News from Whitney, Ontario.